so much, Remy, for that question. And uh, it is a pleasure to be with uh, this panel today. Um, that is a very, very good question because it is live right now. <laughs> this change and this shift is real. Uh, Pre-pandemic, it was um, probably leaders focus was all around the business and really, you know, what are the numbers and, and how do we get there? Post pandemic, this whole thing around collaboration is so important. You're building a new culture and a culture that's not necessarily not focused in on performance and metrics and being successful, but really focusing in on the people and really understanding how the people are feeling, how are they looking to collaborate and work together. Um, this whole notion of balancing work life and family life, being remote, these are not new concepts, but they were so pronounced during this pandemic. And leaders of today are really gonna have to shift the mindset to really focusing in on the people and really understanding that their most valuable assets are their human capital and they have to pay more attention to that. So what does that mean? What that means is you're going to have to have a lot more empathy. You're really going to need to be a little vulnerable as leaders these days because to connect with people is going to be so much more important. Communication becomes one of the key pinnacles of this entire process going forward as a leader. You have to be very open for all communications and it has to be something that is steady on a regular basis. And leaders of today, which are really leaders of tomorrow, are really going to have to step up and understand that connecting to people. We all know we want to see each other real time, but obviously the pandemic showed that we can still stay connected. It has to be intentional. And leaders of today and tomorrow are going to have to be very intentional about what they do and how they do it in order to thrive in this new world, which is really today. And now is all that matters. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah.